Dana has our full forecast and we have some heat. Yes, we do. It was very hot and humid out there earlier mm -hmm. and over this weekend too. The humidity is not going to go away, It'll but unfortunately soon. we also have to sacrifice the sunshine because we got some rain coming in oh, to talk okay. about. But you know, that's all right. Today it was really, really sunny out there. Very warm though. Here's a look at our current heat indexes. So this takes into account the temperature and the humidity. So it feels like 89 in Lewiston, feels like 91 in Augusta, feels like 91 in Freiburg. So for a lot of us, it was a very hot and humid day out there. However, we did get to see plenty of sunshine. We did have some higher clouds move into areas like the county and then some cumulus clouds in areas like western Maine. But despite the amount of moisture in the atmosphere, we overall didn't see that much cloud cover today and it ended up being a very nice afternoon. And that trend will continue overnight tonight. We did have a couple of sprinkles pop up on radar, but most of the showers are light enough where they're not hitting the ground. That is going to change though as we get into the midweek. So tomorrow we'll start out the day likely with some fog around because it's still going to be quite humid. Though once we get into the afternoon, we'll start out with plenty of sunshine and that'll boost our temperatures into the upper 80s and lower 90s in some spots. But the humidity and the heat will give us the chance for some thunderstorms. So areas like southern Maine are in a marginal risk for severe weather for tomorrow's so that is a one out of five on the scale there. So we're watching for some scattered showers and thunderstorms late Tuesday afternoon and early Tuesday evening. And once the sun goes down, those storms begin to calm down a little bit. But then Wednesday, we kind of start out with a different story. We get some more cloud cover earlier in the day. Temperatures still on the warm side into the upper 80s. But then we start to have some more precipitation move in. And the reason for that is currently in Texas. So here's where Tropical Storm Barrel is located, currently impacting areas in Texas and Louisiana. Now, eventually we're going to get some indirect impacts from barrel here. So essentially it's going to continue to move northward, kind of coming towards Maine a little bit, but not directly towards us. Essentially what we're going to get here is some tropically enhanced moisture. So essentially heavier rain. So Wednesday evening into early Thursday, I would say mainly away from the coastline is where we're going to see the heaviest rain here. But because it is tropically enhanced, we could see a fair amount of rain, especially away from the coastline, mainly late Wednesday into early Thursday. So we'll be watching for the potential of some flooding in those areas, but it's not going to be raining on these days all day, nor is it going to be raining over the entire state. And we'll nail that down as we get into the next day or so. So the humidity is really going to stick around because we're going to have some of that tropical air around. Uh, dew points in the upper 60s to lower 70s is going to linger, as is the heat. A lot of us could get the upper 80s and lower 90s tomorrow, and the heat is going to stick around for the rest of the week. Marine forecast sees 2 to 3 feet, water 64 degrees, getting a little warmer out there in the ocean. So here's a look at our seven day forecast. So tomorrow is going to feel very summery. It's going to be hot. It's going to be humid. And we're going to have those afternoon thunderstorms lingering around, especially closer to the coastline and in areas like Western Maine. And then Wednesday, we start out with some more cloud cover. And then Brian and Amanda, we're going to see that kind of tropically enhanced rain move in late Wednesday into early Thursday. And we're going to nail down kind of exactly where those bands of rain are going to be. But keep the umbrella handy for this week. Fair enough. That. Hard to believe that it's not already tropical out there. It's right. going to get more tropical. Yes, it'll even get more on. humid. So we'll be ready. Buckle Dana, down. Thanks so much. <laughs>